last left off, we were purging the foreigners. Uh, and that was quite fun. So, anyway, let's continue because we've just opened up a whole load of new missions. Also, we've got a dapper new look as well. Right. Oh, kill the unworthy monk. Okay. Now, one thing I will mention about this game. Uh, now, there is kind of a reason why I forgot a little bit about the boss fights. And that's because there isn't many. No, really, there isn't many. Um, there's 50 missions in this game and there's three boss fights from what I can remember. Two of them are on the last mission. Yes, the last mission. So that's why that kind of really took me off guard. Uh, I did bring up a bit of a walkthrough for this game, uh, just to, so I know when a boss fight is coming, so I can prepare myself. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay, where's the next boss fight? Where's the next boss fight? Oh, the final mission. Okay, cool. Anyway, let's go. Whereas with, like, Tenchu's, uh, Tenchu 2, uh, that's the one that I kind of remember that's the freshest one in my mind. There's like a boss at the end of every level, I'm pretty sure. Anywho, we're going back to the gambling den. Lovely. Let's go. And uh, Goken, the monk appears to be a virtuous man of the cloth, but he steals donations from the faithful so he can gamble and live extravagantly. This is an outrage for one who claims to be a monk. He must atone for these crimes with his life. Yeah, Goda doesn't fuck around. Um, so, yeah. Uh, <laughs> apparently there isn't any more following missions either. At least, just from a quick skim, I didn't see any. Hello, you sneaky bastard. Ooh. Straight off the bat, we can go take someone out. I like it. Efficient. We like being cold and efficient. Get out of here, dude. New enemy type, by the look of things. Not that that really matters, because they all go down the same. Sounds like there's somebody. And I keep meaning to swap out our uh, ability. Okay. Hopefully that corpse is hidden well enough. Fingers crossed. Yeah, that'll work. If that's as close as he's getting. Yep, that's as close as he's going to come. Sounds good to me. Come here, friend. You almost caught me. Almost. But almost isn't close enough, friend. Right, let's get rid of you. That guy, I think... Are you an innocent? Don't think you are. No, you have a sword on your belt. So you're not innocent. Good. Good. Because I didn't want you to be an innocent. Because if you were an innocent, I wouldn't be able to kill you. And Crimson here, she likes to kill people. It brings her... Unsurmountable amounts of joy. That was close. That was close. It'd be awful if you were dragged into the bush by a young woman and murdered, wouldn't it? Oh, your life is mine. Repent your sins. Oh, well, bit, probably a bit late for that, actually. Because you're already dead. Sorry, friend. Well, am I sorry? Uh, no. No, no, no. No, I don't, I don't think I am sorry. Okay, this is going to be a target-rich environment. Mr. Lantern. Come on. You can protest as much as you like. Not going to get you anywhere. Let's go take you into the bush with, with your friend here. There we go. 
Lovely. Lovely. Oh, a shuriken. Well, don't mind if I do. Just have to wipe the blood off it. But then, if the weapon is used correctly, I'm pretty sure it will collect blood later on. So, now we need to find ourselves another target. Ooh. And what a juicy target it is. Come with me, friend. Oh, there's a nice little item box there as well. Be rude not to have gander, don't you think? There we go. Oof. Nope, that's good. That's a purify. Curious choice of item. Another shuriken. I mean, I guess ninjas need shurikens, right? Okay, now, what's going on up here? Not much. That was a very deep sounding oi. That'll work. Come on, dude. That's it. That's right. There you go. Beautiful. Can't believe we actually got some use out of that ability. That ability that is usually... At least doesn't usually seem that useful. I think we're going to go for that archer next. Yep. Let's take you into this little corner here. And silence these swine. Lovely. I don't know if they ever explain who you're really killing here. I mean, I guess in the grand scheme of things, it's not that important, is it? All we need to know is they're baddies. They're just fodder for the sword. That's good enough for us. Okay. That'll work. Definitely want to be a little bit careful with that. Like we're clear. So we've got a dude over there. We've got you. Come to mama. Go find you a nice little bush to die in, shall we? Yeah, must say, our character's looking pretty fine. There we go. I do like it when you get to create a character. The only trouble is they seem to... Well, they don't really give them a lot of personality, do they? I suppose that makes sense when you're creating a character that's... Essentially a blank slate for the player. Good for role-playing purposes, I suppose. Uh, now... If you're into that sort of thing, I guess. Ooh, hello. Nice. Let's go find a nice little bush for you. Looks like he saved us all of our work for us. Oh, we just missed that red kill there. That's fine. It's not important. Seems to be going fairly well so far. There is another guard over there somewhere. Uh, more drunken guys. Which is cool. Hmm. Mm. Hey, dude. I would say you guys are getting dumber, but I don't think that's the case. <laughs> I don't know what I would have rathered. I, I think it would have been nice for them to make the enemies a little bit smarter. 
Because they really do just feel like uh, robots. Just automatons that are just patrolling a certain area. But they don't have like any kind of AI or anything really that makes them much of a threat, sadly. The guard there. I know there's another guy here somewhere. Oos! That's a throaty sound. Oos! Let's go. Oos! It's got a decent range to it. That sounds a little bit more like it. I don't know why that guy's just not coming. You. Now you. Oh, there's a dog. Damn. That's awkward. Gonna have to get rid of the pooch. Oh, come on. If that dog wasn't there, that would have been perfect. Bastard. Utter. What the hell is that dog doing? Jumping over the doghouse. I mean, cool. I guess. I don't judge. It's going to be hard to kill him, though. Although, if he's just going to be jumping over the doghouse, we don't really have to worry too much about him, do we? <sighs> we do want to try and collect as much money as we can. So that dude there. <laughs> I'm guessing that dog is bugged out because I don't think he's supposed to be doing that. But, you know. I mean, let him have some fun. It's probably not exactly well looked after. Probably, you know, loaded up with mange. I think that's probably just the least of his worries. Somebody has spotted us. Oh. That was close. That was very close. Bit tired there, chap. There you go. You can rest now. And no one can get angry at you. That's the cook. Don't want to hurt the cook. There's a dead dog. But we can't really hurt the dead dog, can we? But we can hurt this guy. We can hurt this guy a lot. You're done. Now, our target is in there. Tempted to call him. But we won't. That was close. That was uncomfortably close. Ah, oh, somebody a little bit sleepy in here. Well, that's okay. We can actually help you with that. Hmm, not in there. Where is the sleepy person? Where is the sleepy person? Oops. You know, that works. Doors are for chumps, apparently. I guess that's just the woman in there. But we know. Aha! There you are. Got ya. Well. No more worries for you, friend. See, I'm doing these guys a favor. You'd think they'd be a little bit more appreciative. Right, 
who's in here? Ooh. Ooh. No, 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 you ain't seen nothing. You ain't seen nothing. God damn it, guys, honestly. That was almost a perfect run. Almost. I knew I should have uh, knocked her out. Where have I gone, mister? Where, oh, where? Right, you've, you're you having it, love. You're having it. You've cost me a lot of coin. God damn it. Oh, you, but now you're stuck in the corner. Great. Just pissing all my points away. God damn it. Where's she gone? Oh, she's in a really awkward situation now. I'm so tempted now to put a sword for a gullet. Oh, you bitch. Right, come here, you. I've had just enough of you. Anything in here worth pilfering? Guess not. Apparently, if you walk into these unconscious people, you can wake them up. I did not know that. I did not know that. Now, this chap... who had his friend murdered, and go join him in the afterlife. There we go. Alright. I'm going to say Crimson's uh, getting acclimatized to her new attire. A little bit uncomfortable, that's what it is. Got to break it all in. New clothes. Ooh. Come on. Oh, I got you. That'll do. Get wrecked. Royally fucked. Definitely should be max rank. No, we didn't lose that much, actually. Oh, I didn't realise. Yeah, we, for stealth killing everybody, we get a hearty bonus as well. Four grand in the purse. Very nice. Now, I think if we get 14%, because uh, I think unlocks are actually done on the percentage of completion. Uh, they're either done, yeah, because I was reading in the guide, they're either done by the percentage of the completion you're at or um, by a certain level. So if you want to unlock them quicker, you can just replay every every mission three times on all the different difficulties. And potentially unlock things quicker. Which is an interesting, you know, thing. Uh, I don't really think I want to buy any more clothing, to be honest. I think we're going to leave it there. So, when we come back, we're going to continue taking over our land. So, till then guys, till then.